This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. Today is the last day to register to vote. Comes as early voting is well underway across the state. More than 400,000 people have already cast their ballots. And here in San Diego, over 400% more mail-in ballots have already been returned compared to this same time in 2016. If you want to vote in the November 3rd presidential general election, Register today to get a mail ballot in the mail. And if you're not sure if you're registered to vote, check your registration status online at sdvote.com. Well, officers at the scene of an officer involved shooting this morning in Mountain View. Someone called to report a man who had uh, a shower rod and was smashing stuff and threatening people. Officers arrived, tried to get everyone out from inside the house. At some point, shots were fired and one man was wheeled out and then taken by ambulance to the hospital. The area blocked off as police continued to investigate. Well, tomorrow, students will return to class in the Vista Unified School District, but some families are looking for more options because they don't agree with how the district plans to bring students back. Last month, the district superintendent said the board approved a memorandum of understanding with the Vista Teachers Association about the reopening plan. But the association claims the current plan goes against what was agreed upon. We're also hearing from the association's president that there may be a motion for a vote of no confidence against the superintendent, and that could happen tonight. Let's get a check on our weather now. Vanessa, how are we looking today? Oh, we are looking mighty fine and very cool, I should add, as we give you a live look out from our Cardiff Sky Cam. We have a marine layer hanging out with us this morning, especially along the coastline through those coastal neighborhoods. Once that does mix out, though, we will see plenty of sunshine throughout the county from the coast all the way to the mountain areas. We'll top out in the mid to upper 70s along the coast, mid 80s inland, still staying above average for this time of the year. But I promise we will see below average temperatures for this time of the year as we uh, get through the week and we do even have a rain chance that's going to make an appearance towards the end of the weekend. Jim. Vanessa, thank you very much. And for the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.